90% of Americans drink coffee. If you're a coffee drinker, there's some good news about the effect on your health. Research found drinking one or more cups of coffee was associated with the decreased risk of heart failure. KXAN's Sally Hernandez spoke with an Austin heart and sleep expert on this new study. The latest studies suggest that uh, there is actually a lot more to know about caffeine, and it's really good news. Can tell me about the latest study. So it turns out that caffeine doesn't just make you less sleepy. The latest studies show that it improves attention span, improves brain function and processing, uh, and even improves driving safety, although we still recommend not driving if you're sleepy, even if you have caffeine. So caffeine's kind of gotten a bad rap over the years and turns out not to be as bad as we thought. When you think of caffeine, you think of, of coffee that makes your you jumpy or, or your heart jittery. Um, that's not necessarily the case. Um, there's a difference between the way caffeine makes you feel and what it does to the heart. So yeah, some people when they drink caffeine feel a little bit more jittery, a little bit more wired. But in terms of actual dangerous heart arrhythmias, um, the, the impact of caffeine has probably been overstated and the studies are a little bit more reassuring about the safety of uh, using at least reasonable doses of caffeine. How much caffeine are we talking about here, doctor? Like, are we talking about one cup of coffee? That's good for me. Can I have three or four? That's good for me. In general, it should be okay to drink about one to four cups of coffee a day. If you're a four cup of coffee person, you probably want to spread it out a little bit, not drink it all at once. So for example, if you're a smoker, your metabolism of caffeine can double, which makes you break it down faster and the effect wears off faster. Now, on the flip side of things, certain hormones and medications like standard birth control pills slow down your metabolism of caffeine and make it linger in the blood longer, which can make it last a real long time and lead to some pretty sleepless nights. The doctor also says if you're drinking more than four cups of coffee a day and you are still feeling sleepy, there may be some underlying problems to talk to your doctor about.